You have arrived at your destination. Guys, here I am in North Miami Beach, right off of this main road here, Dixie Highway, at the site of Daniel Daffenbach by Centennial Park. And while the park is lovely, that's not exactly what we're here to see. No? Today, ladies and gentlemen, does it look a little Spanish to you in orientation? Well, it should, because this is the site of North Miami Beach's very own ancient Spanish monastery. So guys, this is a Spanish monastery known as St. Bernard de Clairvaux. And it was built in the year 1133 AD. It was built in a town called Sacramenia in Northern Spain. And the construction of it was completed in the year 1141 AD. So you might ask yourself, barefoot, it was built in Spain? Well, what's it doing here? That's a great question, my friends. Let's go take a closer look. Right here, guys, in North Miami Beach, we have our little piece of ancient history. This monastery, if you can believe it, was painstakingly taken apart block by block, piece by piece, and shipped to the United States in 1925 by none other than William Randolph Hearst, who paid to have that done. Look at the ceilings, guys. Just imagine it had to carve these angles into these stones that form the ceilings. How they painstakingly took all of this apart to bring it here, a long journey back in 1925, and then take it out of the boxes that were filled with hay um, and put it all back together like a giant stone puzzle. It's, it's unbelievable. In fact, at the time that they shipped the crates here a hoof and mouth disease broke out in Spain so they they were concerned about the hay that was packed in the crates and they didn't want to open them therefore when they got the crates here all 11,000 had to be opened and the hay removed so that it could be burned to prevent the spread of disease I should take a bath in that. So here's the actual sanctuary itself, I guess. Really cool, guys. No, I've been to places like the Biltmore and the Breakers, you know, pretty historic buildings by Florida's history standards. 
but nothing really compares to this. I mean, you're talking about something very close to a thousand years old that's right here, right in our midst. Beautiful courtyard here. And you can see those red Spanish tile roofs adorning the top of this incredible structure. These monastery walls that are solid blocks of stone. And of course, the medieval archways making their way around this courtyard square. Guys, if I didn't know any better, I would swear I was like in a fortress somewhere in Granada in Spain or something right now. But no, this is our own little piece of Spanish history right here in North Miami Beach. So today, this serves as a church here for the community. And in fact, if you're planning a wedding, you could actually Get married right here at the ancient Spanish monastery. It's hard to believe that these stones were crafted almost a thousand years ago. Still serving their purpose to this day, right here in Florida. I heard of the headless horseman. One of the headless three musketeers. Wow. Hopefully that didn't happen in shipping. And you can see the Spanish escutcheon here. Years ago when I was in junior high school, I remember the vice principal, Mr. Vardis, um, he had a wooden bench outside his office. And if you were sitting on that wooden bench, it meant you did something wrong. And uh, this kind of brings back memories of old Bardis's bench. Oh, wow. Mm -hmm. Looks like maybe this is one of the original doors that they kept here. So guys, in here is the hall where they have various, you know, church functions and also this is probably where the wedding reception would take place. Private tour, guys. Only on the Barefoot Vlogger Network. So I guess this is um, like the coat and hat check right here. Very cool. And even on the inside, they have some of these stone columns. Here, it says it right here. These are column fragments that still remain. From the late medieval Renaissance, So you can see as it still serves as a church here, you can um, burn a candle for a dollar and um, make a nice prayer here at the ancient Spanish monastery. What's through this archway? Let's walk through it and find out. Guys, look at the grounds that it's on. I mean, we haven't even talked about that. Look at how beautiful this is. I mean, I wouldn't even call it a park-like setting. This looks like a kingdom's ground almost. Look at this. And the view of the building 
from these grounds and that tree with the fountain. Guys, I'll tell you what. It's worth coming here for a look between all of the history that's here and just the peacefulness of the place. It's, it's spectacular. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this little tour of the ancient Spanish monastery here in North Miami Beach. Definitely try to stop by and take a visit if you're in the area. Till next time, this is the Barefoot Vlogger saying, stay well, stay tuned.